So if Digital Scrapbook Artist 2 sounds like more fun than a dry desktop publishing program, and the start page certainly gives this impression, but does it last? There are five themes supplied with the software and more can be downloaded from the internet. Some are free and others you have to pay for. Within that, each template has several other layouts that you can then select and use for your projects. The interface is busy and there are lots of different windows around the sides of the screen. For example, it took us some time to work out how to replace the sample photos on the layouts. The solution is relatively simple once you know what you're doing. Click on the Photos tool, then Add, find the pictures you want, select, click on open and there they are. What we do like is that when you drag and drop them onto the page they're automatically rotated to match the frame. It's a shame that there isn't the same level of help as we have found in Page Plus and Web Plus other products from Serif. Both of these include tutorial videos as well as PDF file excerpts from the full printed manual. For those willing to explore the options there are some powerful tools such as stencils. You can drag and drop a stencil onto a page Select a drawing tool with an attractive brush and then fill in the area in the stencil. You don't have to worry about meeting the edges. You can go over them a little bit. Select the stencil tool again and then lift stencil and you can see there that we got an attractive drawing on the page. Now the experts will recognize this as using a mask but Serif deserve credit for making this an accessible tool. Strapbook pages can be printed, exported as a PDF file or uploaded to the Serif Daisy Trail website. While it might not be quite as fun as getting out the glue and the scissors, Serif Digital Scrapbook Artist 2 offers some good and professional looking ways of making projects with your photos.